<laughs> Hi everybody, welcome back to the Mess of All Movies. DVD collector. We got a few things to show off again. You probably go ahead and see them over and over and over. And I'm hoping a lot of people will comment on each movies that you have seen before. The ones that we have been collecting. The ones you've seen before are the new releases. I thought I have another 4K. It looks like I don't somewhere. So. That's okay. Everybody knows what I got in the past. Now, let's go ahead and dive in the step books because you know what I have been getting lately. And before you leave this video, please do not forget to subscribe and like and comment down below. For every eighth video that I actually upload and put on my channel. Make sure you also respect the channel. Respect me as your host, your owner, and your boss. And don't forget to actually check out each video that you guys have forgotten in the past. So. Let's go ahead and, and dive right in. We got quite a few Starbucks. You have seen my first time watches. An amazing movie that I got and recommend. First off, I will go ahead and Show off the Johnny Depp of Lango of Nickelodeon. Great film. Recommend by Tony for Business Blues. I don't know why he got off on YouTube lately on my videos. But. Look, he's still corroborating the, the way he's been talking to me lately. I think he overdid it to be on, on vacation. He recommended a lot of these. We got Twin Moves, Glow in the Dark, Seven Movie Collection. I haven't seen it yet, but I'm hoping I will. I like the texture, I like, I like the, the emboss. It's really cool from inside. Um, your next is really a good movie. I enjoyed this. Out of the seven. So I'm hoping to get the others as well, and also I spit on the grave was good. <clears throat> mm. I don't know when Tony actually spin out for control, which by the way, he did. So he is stopping commenting on my videos. You went off more than just a deep end. So he's off on Instagram like, like forever. Is he ever get back on 
I doubt it. He's really upset. He probably deserves it. No way, he's been talking to me lately. No, as for me, I don't talk to him as bad like I used to. Biffy Blues has been really nice to me ever since he recommended uh, a thousand of movies a day. Two movies a day or a movie a day. Or clearly in a week. But he has been a really good friend. But I'm not going to forgive him for what he did to me. So let's go ahead and move on. We got the last unicorn. I really enjoyed the last unicorn movie. And, um... Jessica, who plays in this, very good. I like the voice which she did. This is a Shout Studio. I like the modern of the artwork. It's very amazing. <clears throat> the first time, the first week, I got the planet of the kingdom of the planet of the apes. Yes, I've been really wanting to upgrade my uh, planet of the apes collection, which I hope I will down the line. It is a very fantastic movie. This is the blue ray. I want to get if it just yeah, because it never take too long for, for a simple video for everyone I can see. So that's Kingdom Planet of the Apes. So I'm hoping to rewatch some of these. These have been my favorite ones. And the ones I've been getting at Walmart, but by the way, I've been helping with my aunt lately, her house and everything. And Chris Hemsworth and Edward Taylor Joy, my mom and dad split the cost of the Mad Max saga. saga. I have other movies of this particular movie. I like it. It is my worth of the money is. It's a really good movie. It's hard to see on the bottom. Kind of dark looking, but putting on is pretty good step up. Now, last time we checked at Walmart, guess what I found? But three hours long, as the same as Christopher Nolan's Abenhauer. Kevin Gosner in the Horizon Chapter 1. So Walmart is sending out one by one of my favorite still books by Lionsgate, I think. So I can get my own chance to build up and keep adding to my still book collection. That's a pretty good step book. But it's three hours, so three hours. I'm gonna wait until a day or so and check out Horizon. I'll be checking the other step books as possible if I can stay up that long and that late. Not the day that I work, but the days I don't work at the Y. I'll get a chance to watch. Now, as the other step books go, I noticed that we little late getting started just a little bit. 
Now, I know everybody will be asking, why did you go off Tony the way I did? It's really Tony's business. I wasn't trying to be up to him or anything. But, Big and Meat Blues has been very tolerant with everything I say. So I'm hoping he'll get back on Instagram, but I doubt that. I don't think he, he's ever going to do that. Because as for, as for Tony, he has been blocking me for years. And I'd like to know the truth about everybody on this YouTube. We, as um, subscribers and YouTubers, I'd like to know. Why are we friends? Why are we subscribers? Why aren't we on YouTube? Why are we friends? Why are we subscribers? What's the whole point of being over 12 years ago that no one has been paying attention to me ever since I got on YouTube? I have upgraded my phone since, let me check here. I'm trying to see. Okay, I, I actually joined YouTube in February 2nd of last year, in a 2003, and I got 133 and 66 one views on here. So why am I killing myself to actually to be on YouTube. I'd like to know why. And I want some answers. And I want them right now. Let's try to continue with the movie. Why are we a family? Why are we friends? Why are we subscribers? Why are we collectors? I'd like to know because over the years that none of you guys have been actually commenting on my videos for real. Tony has, Scott has, I don't know if everybody else has, Except for her, while well, back when I was having him, for the loss of his family, I had him a lot. And a few others as well. So, I don't know what's wrong with you guys, but I need to know what's going on. Now, the ones we are adding still, we got the Meg. I guess I like to add some more shock movies to my collection. That's a pretty good stair book. I have Meg, Meg 2, and the Trench 4K. Now, the stair book. I'm not to break it, but I'm trying to close it. Meg was good. Little Monsters is awesome. We got Harry Miguel and French Savage, which is the older brother of, uh, for Ben Savage of Corey Matthews. 
I enjoy the monsters. I have seen it before. It's a great film. I enjoy it. I have it on DVD. So I am still upgrading the stuff up. We still have Moon Knight. I haven't seen it yet, but I'm hoping I will. Of the complete first season. My great image, great things. We have cards. I keep things in the, the staff box so we can keep them inside so it won't get lost. I love the Marvel side of the staff box. I wish I had more of the AMC um, what you call that? Uh, Marvel series. Marvel Steph Books. We got Sean Van Dam. Sean Claude. Kickboxer. I really enjoy it. We have my fast ones, The Gate, you know about my warm movie, I haven't seen The Gate yet, and then The Naked Gun. The magnet I have from The Naked Gun is on my fridge. So those are the stuff books we got in. And the ones that I showed you was actually the newest ones. These are the newest ones I showed you. Then we got the Undeniably Warfare on 4K for God for G's. I haven't seen it yet, but I'm hoping to do a watch it sooner or later. And then we got Boy Kill Squirrel on 4K. I will add some Blu-rays to the collection. New ones are coming. Oh, by the way, my Friday the 13th, um, my first pre-order will be coming soon. It's still coming. It's just late. It's actually late getting here. So, so don't worry guys, I will let you know when it's coming. Now you know about the DVDs, we got these at Walmart. So I'm going to keep on showing this one until somebody comment on this movie uh, for a second. And then Bruce Willis and Die Hard. We got The Walking Dead, The Ones Who Live. Some of these I probably will watch when I get the chance. Chucky Season 3. Some of these will be in my room because I have dolls in there. Then we get Wednesday if you like um, Adam's Family. And then we have the first Omen. Let me know down below in the comment section, please. So these are the streaming services. Um, others that I picked up all along the way.
to me, girl. Then we got Rubble Cup on DVD and Blu ray. Two disc set. We got Terminator, that double feature. Also, a two disc set. Don't worry, I will let you know when I get the trays in for the replacements for the uh, boys. We got good boys. And there we go, Kidnap with my personal favorite, Halle Berry. Halle Berry, who does the author of The Call. She's my favorite actress of all the movies that she's had played. So those are just all my DVDs. Those are the ones I like. These are not from Walmart. These are for, for one more in all time. So these are the ones that I actually got myself. Sometimes my dad helps me. Now let's, let's go ahead and go to the um, Blu-ray section here, the ones I got. Now, I want to watch Inside 2 because it looks like everybody is coming on the big Oscar winning of Inside 2. So I'm definitely going to head out and we'll watch this one tonight. Sometime down the line this weekend. I'm doing um, Muffin Tack. I'm going to Odessa, Melon. So I'm picking up some movies that I'm getting. Frogman, Terror Vision. Like I said, I will replace this case. When I can, you can see it's open right here. We have the A24 horror. Out of the five film collection that I do enjoy, I'm glad I got this because it's been a long time. That I've been eyeballing the i24 horror. We have the F. Monkey Man, I got to revisit. Bike riders that needs to upgrade to a 4K. Challengers. Chosen, chapter four, and then we got Panda, we got animation as well, four exclusive shorts. Let me know down below, should I watch them? No, I know everybody's eyeballing the inside too. Then we got Abigail. Which I gotta rewatch sometime next week or this week. I will let you know what I'm planning to pick up this Thursday. We got Godzilla X Kong. 
Ghostbusters for the Empire. I haven't seen it yet, but we'll do. In another animation, we got Migration. So that is it, everybody. Thank you so much to recommend a lot of these for me. Next soon, subscribers who actually cares about my movies. And who actually wants me to do these on YouTube. So you tell me, you, all of you out there, execute me. Why are we subscribers? Why are we friends? Why do we subscribe? You tell me down below. And why it's so important to be in this community. So, you tell me. Why am I killing my time to talking to, to someone on Instagram? Is it just because I'm being such a bother to everybody? Am I annoying everyone? Why am I getting everybody on the skin? Are you that tired of me? Are you trying to get rid of me? I like to know with all those questions. Am I here to be a bullhead? Okay. And I'm not here to be obsessed and obsession with Tony. My Tony needs to understand where I'm coming from. He doesn't like have people talk back to him. Well, he just got his own medicine. This totally has been great for me. And so is everybody else. So I'm trying to get my, my best to collect the ones of the movies that I'm trying to get in my, my collection. And put them with exactly what they put should be in. So you let me know. You guys will actually tell me. Don't lecture me, but let me know. What is wrong with you people? I'm not trying to lose everyone for my subs. I have 830 subscribers. It's down to 829 right now. But I am not trying to be zero zip with nothing on my channel but it's really important to me that deeply care in my heart do what I want to do and do what I want to share but you guys have been recommended so much over the years of the year that before we ever get started collecting I had collected the most since we moved here over 20 years and I was 19 when I first started. 19 years old when I first started and I got older because I love horror movies. That's why I got a channel. That's why I got this much. So you, so you all tell me what's going on out there. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I see you guys tomorrow. What else we can talk about? Because now I'm adding some new stuff. I'm doing DVDs during the day. That's the whole new thing that I'm doing the channel. So give me support and love and everything. And I see you guys another time. That's a wrap.